Good morning. Good morning, Shaw. It's 9.12 a.m. It's currently 19 degrees and sunny there. Today, it'll be partly cloudy, with a forecasted high of 34 and a low of 14. Due to current wind conditions, it feels like it's 10. Have a great day. Here's your morning news update. Oh. Hey, good morning, y'all. Hey, this ice. It definitely is going to be a problem this morning. Hey, I brought a new microphone out with me this morning. I don't know how it sounds because I ain't got no headphones on. But I didn't just buy it. I've had it for a while. I actually, it broke like as soon as I bought it. So I kind of got it rigged up so it'll work because I didn't want to send it back. It's a very nice microphone. I'll let you check it out right quick and I'll show y'all what happened to it. You see that right there? I put a zip tie around it because the compartment where the batteries go in. Yep. That thing broke like, like day one, maybe. So it never, the compartment never closed. So I put that zip tie on it. And now I can slide the zip tie up and down so that it keeps the battery compartment closed. It's rigged, but it works. Only problem is I would never trust this microphone now in a situation where it has to work. Because if that zip tie fails me, just like if the door failed me. So basically, I guess what I'm saying is this ain't the type of mic that I would use in a situation where you're worried about something failing you. Because that battery door compartment is very brittle and fragile. And... uh yeah made it so i couldn't use it for a long time until i figured out how to use the zip tie on it so you can either get get prepared to get creative or uh look for another mic i guess i don't know how the audio quality sounds i never really got to use it much because the battery compartment door broke as soon as i got it so i guess this is my first review of this microphone huh <laughs> and it went off to a bad start but we off to a good morning. How y'all doing this morning? Y'all let me know what y'all think about this mic. This is my first time using it in a video. Because the last time I used it, it broke. <laughs> first time I used it. And I've had it over a year now. Just didn't know how to use it with the department, compartment being broken. I don't like sending stuff off to get it fixed. Because, I don't know. I feel like I should have returned it. But I had it too long to return it. I was very disappointed because for the price, I wasn't happy with the build quality of the battery door. And I got it to work. It's still a good mic. What I like about it is you can change these mics with the, the Zoom H5 and the Zoom H6. Hold on. This is the Zoom F1. So I have the Zoom H6. And uh, Mac Dime, who's also on YouTube, he uh, he traded me a bag for the Zoom. I think it was the H5. Uh, Mac Dime, if you see this video, let me know. I think it was the H5 is what I traded you for that bag. And then I have the Zoom H1 and the Zoom H6. And the Zoom H6 is what I came out here with in the beginning and was doing the audio sounds with the shotgun mic on it. The first time I came out, I came out with this microphone on it, and it was the being able to go from right to left, and then I started trying to listen to the sounds. So I had put the shotgun microphone on this mic, but since I'm hand-holding it, you could hear every shotgun microphone sound in it. Let's see what this sounds like. And I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna test this microphone audio quality versus the GoPro Max audio quality. You tell me which one you think sounds better.
Hey, it's Saturday, yeah. I know for a barber, that's odd, but your boy don't work on Saturdays. That's because I'm gonna be honest with y'all, family time is much more important to me. Now, I'm not saying that I won't cut anybody's hair on a Saturday. What I'm saying is, family time is more important to me. Meaning if my family wants my time on a Saturday, they're guaranteed to get it. Guaranteed. And if I made any promises to anybody that I was gonna cut their hair on a Saturday, if my family requires something from me on a Saturday, they get it. And there's a reason for that. And I don't care how people feel about it. What I'm saying is my family had to sacrifice Saturdays, Sundays, and every other day during my military career. And when I got out the military, I promised them as soon as I was capable of making it so I didn't have to work on a Saturday, I was not gonna work on a Saturday. And so, as long as my family wants my time on a Saturday, they always gonna get it. No job, until my kids are grown, until they're grown, if they want my time on a Saturday or a Sunday, Sundays, that's a difference. That's a little bit different. Sunday ain't even for my family. Sunday's for me and God. I'm gonna be straight with y'all. That's when I do me and him time, kind of like these mornings. But what I'm saying is, Saturdays are for my family, it's guaranteed. I'm out here in the park and in the creek walking. But what I'm saying is, whoa, that's ice. <laughs> hey, what I'm saying is good morning, y'all. It's Saturday. And I'm enjoying myself out here in this park. Hey. Listen to the sound. I hope that sounded amazing because I love the way it sounded when I came out here with the Zoom A6, but that was with the shotgun mic. The shotgun mic don't sound good on this one, hand holding it, it don't. But it, I'm, I'm loving that it fits. Once I figure out how to make it so it sounds good, I'm gonna be bringing it out that way. And then I didn't bring a filter for this, so I don't know how that's gonna make it sound. Whoa, whoa, that was slippery. But what I do know is, oh, this is where we gonna get out at. We ain't gonna play around in this creek, even though it's Saturday and I could do a super long video. I ain't trying to, well, you know what, y'all? I'm thinking about 30 minutes is good. If somebody disagree, I'm saying, somebody could turn on my videos and get on a treadmill and do an exercise. So I'm thinking my videos could be good at about 30 to 45 minutes. I'm saying I got some tractor videos that's about to be coming out, but they're gonna be an hour long. So I guess what I'm saying is, I'm not looking for people who are trying to just uh, get some information quick and get out. What I'm saying is, hey, this is an opportunity to spend time together, yeah? <laughs> I'm spending time with y'all, y'all spending time with me. Good morning. I'm out getting my steps in. And this is how we gonna do it. I don't know about this mic, but I just wanted to play around with it because what I'm saying is, this is the opportunity for me to learn. And so I'm taking advantage of everything I can. This microphone, this camera, this exercise. I'm even learning how to talk better, I'm noticing, the more I do these videos. I'm gonna get a little bit more organized and, and have specific details and facts to tell you about. But right now, I'm trying to learn the process. And I'm appreciative of everybody who's teaching me along the way. Because really, how this whole thing really works to me is help me be better. Tell me what you think I can do. Give me some things to talk about. But you gotta be consistent with me too. If you give me things consistently to talk about, I'll talk about them. But you gotta also give me ways Whoa, this ice. Woo. Whoa. You gotta also give me ways to, to learn, show improvement. But I'm saying y'all can help me get better. And I, I feel like y'all already are. And then with me, the drive that I have to want to get better, I'm saying, I feel like it's gonna happen. Y'all let me know when y'all feel like I get that. 
And I want y'all to call me out. I'm saying, I'm a different kind of dude. I don't feel like, like I'm the type of person who change. I'm saying, yeah, if I make enough money, yeah, my house might change. But what I'm saying is, I feel like I'm always gonna be a giving and caring person. The more I get, the more I feel like I can give. I feel like that's the point of life, not to hold in your blessings. I ain't saying y'all won't ever see me get a bigger or nicer vehicle or house. What I'm saying is, I love and respect everybody who helped me get to where I am. I don't ever want to be the type of person who's looked at as the type of person who forgot anybody. I'm saying, yeah, I'll be your MC Hammer. I'll go broke giving, I don't care. It feel better to give than to have everything and nobody to give it to. Yeah, that's me. That's why I feel like I'm giving y'all my best already. Y'all getting my mornings. You know how I feel about my mornings. Hey, good morning, y'all. We out here getting it in. Hey, this is the best time of the day. I'm just not figuring this out, y'all. I'm just not figuring this out. Hey, 40 years, I used to complain. Oh, I can't stand getting up in the morning. Hey, I look forward to the morning so much now. Ooh, and the feeling that I'm about to get out here and talk to some of y'all. Hey, everybody ain't gonna listen, but I can see who is and I appreciate y'all. Now, what I need y'all to do, what we always do. What did you do yesterday and make yourself better for today? Cause tomorrow ain't guaranteed. But I want you to know, hey, what you did yesterday, now that junk don't matter. If you still celebrating about what you did yesterday, hey, you working wrong. It's time to get out here and start working for the day. What's your plans for the day? Give it to me, leave a comment. I told y'all I never beg for nobody to subscribe. If you can't, look, what I'm saying is, if me being me ain't good enough, I'm saying I ain't for you. That's all it mean to me. I ain't trying to get everybody. I'm just trying to get those who feel like I have what they need, that's it. You need to see the wilderness, you don't get to get outside, hey, tune in. You need some motivation, ain't got nobody you feel like that's gonna give it to you, and give it to you straight, I will. Talk to me, leave me a text, or not a text, but a comment. I'm telling you, I do my best to reply to every one of them. And I feel like I'm doing pretty good right now. Hey, people be leaving me smiles and stuff like that. I do, I just leave a heart on that because I still appreciate it. I do appreciate it. You can leave anything, a comment is a comment. But the more you talk to me, the more I talk to you. Now, I ain't the most of reading, you know what I'm saying? Don't be leaving me no comments that's no two and three pages long. Oh my goodness. It'll take me all night just to read that. <laughs> uh, hey, but I appreciate y'all. Definitely, because I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Y'all have become my motivation. Seeing the responses that I'm getting on these videos, like I thought that people were gonna think me coming out here and walking was gonna be lame, which I'm sure some people do. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, I don't do things and worry about those who don't like it. Man, you spend your life, your whole life trying to please people. You'll never be able to please. What I'm saying is there's a people out there that like just what I do. I'm saying I see that from the barbershop to the way people respond to me out in public. Like, I see some people out in public and they don't wanna have nothing to do with me. I see some people out in public and it's like, they become my best friends instantly as soon as we meet. I'm saying that's the way I feel like everything in life is, even YouTube. Like, some people you just gonna click with, some people you not. I don't never force a relationship. If we ain't clicking, we ain't clicking. Click on. <laughs> I ain't in this for the clicks. I'm in this to try and really reach people. I don't care how many people I reach. Those that I reached meant it was important to reach them. And I'm saying good morning to y'all. Hey, the one bad thing about this microphone, and I hope I didn't just yell at it. Hey, this boy hurting my arm holding it up like this. <laughs> 
switch hands. Maybe I just switch gears. You see how I can just switch subjects like this? Look. <laughs> Hey, what I like about bringing this microphone out with me, though, is if my video fails, I feel like I still have audio. And my audio would still be good enough. I, I, I don't care. I could listen to this audio. I mean, y'all would hear me mainly, but... I mean... <laughs> hey, I be having fun, y'all. Y'all ain't gonna mess with me too long. <laughs> y'all wanna go back under this? I'm feeling like it. What you think? Under or over? Well, I got this mic, so if I go over. Now, let's just go under. Let's not get too fancy today. I got new equipment out here. <laughs> Look at that ice, y'all. Y'all can't see it good. I know you can't. Oh, man, I really can't see it. Now, let's put both feet on this one rock. And now you can see how low I am. Let's turn. And I'm still under the log right now. Actually, my back is touching the log right now. But... Oh yeah, here y'all wanna see where the log is? I put one hand right here. Let me, hey, come on log, work with me here, baby. Ah, right, here we go, here we go. There go that log right there. There it is, how low can you go, baby? Oh, oh okay, that's good enough. We showed y'all enough now. Oh, I don't wanna get wet today. Oh, Ooh, there we go, yep. They go that long. I don't know how to show you how high that is. It's about this high. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I love that log. Hey, I'm telling you, I would have never been able to do that until I started stretching after I swim. I love that. Oh, speaking of swimming, your boy went swimming yesterday. Hey, go ahead and get a look at that. Hey, good morning, guy. It's Saturday. I went swimming on Friday. Yep. Y'all gonna get that every once in a while. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie. I do that because what I'm saying is, it looks strange to hold a lot of these photos and videos and stuff in my phone of myself. Who else is to give them to? I want memories of what I looked like when I was 40. I'm saying I used to always hear stories and this ain't no blows at nobody. I'm just saying, people used to tell me when I was a kid, man, when I was your age, when I was your age, I used to, I used to, and I'm like, hey, I'm trying to tell my kids right now. I don't want to tell you what I was doing at your age. I want to show you what I was doing at your age. So I'm doing one of two things by making these videos. <laughs> I'm showing them. Uh-oh, here we go with this junk again. We know not to mess around with this stuff no more. Hey, I think you're right. This is that area right here. That's that area where I said... I think that this is a dam, and I still believe that to be true. Like, I believe that to be true. And the reason I say that is because all of this over here, I thought that was under underground. It's not. It's not underground. That is still where they're building at, it looks like. But I said I was gonna look and see if there was any signs of like beavers and stuff out here because i don't see any trees chewed on i mean i don't know can anybody point out any signs if you know what signs of beaver look like because i don't i'm not look i'm not a survivalist or a wildlife person oh forgot i was talking to a microphone <laughs> see that's a problem but i bet you gopro picked that up pretty good i guess what i'm saying is I don't know this kind of stuff. This is how I learn. People point things out to me in my videos. What do you think caused this besides just trees getting blocked up right here? Is that what you think happened here? Because what I'm saying is, this is the one area that is deep enough for something to swim up underneath this whole mound right here. Now, it looks like trees just got pushed down here and got stuck. But I'm saying, I don't see this kind of stuff anywhere else. And if you look up there, it's like the rocks 
made a perfect waterfall here too. I don't know. Are there signs of beaver activity out here? Somebody let me know. Hey, I gotta get back to getting my steps. That's what I mean. This creek always stop me from getting my steps. Hey, we normally go that way. Let's go this way this time. Oh, that looks tight. Oh, that look, uh. oh, I was fishing there. And this is one where they be stuck in. That's cool. Wow. Oh, I might be fish stuck in this one too. I don't know if y'all can see him. Ooh, you see that stick hit the ice. I bet you it's fish stuck in that one too. I don't see him though. Oh yeah. We gonna come back up this way. But I gotta get some more steps, y'all. This is what I'm saying. When I get around that creek, I love the sounds. And then I like to play around with the microphone on the creek. And the next thing you know, I ain't got no steps. Oh, this is all ice too. Man, there's a lot of people walking on this part. All right, let's see how many steps I got. 2,500. Oh, we gonna be horrible this morning. Whoa. Ooh, it's slippery. Oh yeah. Hey, it's not that bad out today though, y'all. Like, it's cold. But it's like cool cold, not cold cold. Like, I feel pretty warm actually right now. Let's go this way so we can get down out of water. Oh no. See? That's gonna be a problem right there. I blew that audio out. I know. I don't know where I blew it out at. <clears throat> That's why it's going to be better to have this on the GoPro. The audio, at least. Oh, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Uh-oh. The water dropped too. I wonder what happened. That's tight, though. Oh, shoot. Man, I was just standing underneath the fallen tree. What if that boy would have fell the rest of the way? That could have hurt. <laughs> that was tight, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's ice. That's ice. Look. That's ice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, buddy. It's nice out here today. Oh, wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, y'all. Ooh, look. Ice. Splash! You see how far that went? That's tight. Oh, all the way across, baby. Splash! Oh, all the way across. Let's go. Splash. Ah! Uh. Oh, I could do this all morning. Ah! Let's go all the way across, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Hey, this is fun, y'all. See, this is what I'm saying. I can sit out here and have fun like this all day. Splash. Look at that. I can have fun like this all day long. And it's Saturday, so I think I might. Uh, I'm going to go get the kids and tell them we got to come out here and play. <laughs> I'm the type of dad who make my kids go play. Yup, y'all gonna have fun with me. Yeah, I just start wrestling matches with him for no reason. My youngest, he's starting to get carried away with it though. He wanna wrestle at all hours of the night now. Yup. That's why I had kids. <laughs> they my favorite toys. <laughs> I got problems, I know. Yup. All I want to do is beat up on them all day. I hate that they getting older. Now it's starting to get harder to beat them. <laughs> they really be fighting to take me down. Oh man, look at this one. Hey, so I'm gonna really have to listen to this with the audio because I know I done messed up on the audio now. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Uh, 
Why I say I, I told y'all I wasn't gonna play? Look, y'all gotta start reminding me. I wish y'all could just be like, hey, y'all, get out the creek, bro. You, your step count low. Cause I'm telling you, the more I walk in this creek, the longer these videos gonna be. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> y'all gotta start telling me, y'all, stay up out the creek, bro. Stay up out the creek. Oh. Hey, I be trying to get 5,000 steps on camera first thing in the morning. But uh, I ain't making y'all no promises because I be saying some things sometimes. Nah, I try not to edit my videos. Except for my walk from my house. I don't like showing everybody how to get to my house from the creek. Because <laughs> this is a park and there are people locally that watch me. But I don't mind that. But I just don't be wanting people popping up in my yard. Like, I hate that. Not that I think that they're doing it because of my YouTube channel. But it's just because of my footsteps in the snow. I hate them coming through my yard. And then they be rude to me when they do it. That is horrible, people. Don't be rude. We should be nice to everybody all the time. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm trying to stay near the creek as much as possible. Cause I love hearing the sound. This was probably one of the best things that I ever found. Like, like I never expected this to be here when we bought our house. And to be able to walk to it from my, from my yard without having to cut through somebody else's yard. That's like amazing to me. Oh, here we go. To, hey, we gonna play around here for a minute. So, uh, I don't care. This is gonna be a long video. Hey, Saturday is gonna be a long video. I mean, I guess it's going to be Sunday when y'all watch this one. Hey. Well, no. I hate to take up our... Oh, boy. See, here come two dogs. They better not start barking. Oh, speaking of dogs, guess what, y'all? One of my clients came in yesterday, and he told me what kind of dog to get. And I think it is probably the best decision, and I want to get it. Yeah, the dog I think I'm going to get. I thought it was going to be a German Shepherd, but now the dog I think I'm going to get. I don't know if y'all can hear me. Hold on. See how it's sad if I walk over here. The dog I want to get, drum roll please, a border collie. Hey, suppose this is the smartest dog in the world. I mean, that's the dog I should have. I mean, smartest owner in the world, smartest dog in the world. <laughs> so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and get me a border collie, but I want it to be brown, wouldn't it? A brown border collie. The brown ones with blue eyes are beautiful to me. <laughs> hey, check this out, y'all. I can't see right here. Is this deep? Get out the way, Ice. Hey. Oh, man. I know it ain't. It ain't. Oh, it's deeper than I thought, though. Oh. Yeah, it is deeper than I thought. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, bro. It's definitely deeper than I thought. <laughs> Somebody saw me and said, Are you all right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, this is great. Ah, oh, yeah. Look at the ice on the top of it. I don't know how good you got to see that. Oh, that's tight. That is dope to me. Look, that's ice. That's ice. That's tight. Look at this. Yeah. Hey, I had fun with, ooh. Ooh, I had fun with this video, y'all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. This junk is so dope to me. And I ain't been down here since this ice. I never made it this far. 
Hey. This is dope. Whoa, that's ice. Ooh, ooh, that's ice too. Hey, that looks so tight from over here. Hey, this is amazing, y'all. I could do this every morning. Wait, I do. <laughs> uh, I really do. So what do y'all think about me getting a border collie, y'all? And then who was it that said uh, I could put the camera on the dog and just forget about it? Hey, I think I want a border collie because what I'm saying, border collies, they had like the biggest hearts, I guess, out of dogs, right? They can run and do stuff forever. So if I brought my mountain bike out here border collie should be able to keep up definitely be able to keep up with the tractor i mean the tractor would never be too fast for a border collie four-wheeler not in my yard border collie can keep up with the four-wheeler in my yard oh look at this today yeah uh, oh that's ice i guarantee it yep that's ice right there hey this looks so dope today so dope today well i said today i said today don't be correcting my speaking <laughs> It's so dope today. Look at that. Oh, that's dope. Look at that. That's dope. I like that. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, it's beautiful out here. Now let's go up here right quick. I ain't seen this yet. Y'all ain't seen this yet. Ooh, this is like a furthest video, y'all. A new furthest. We are about to go to it right now. Let's see what this is. We cheated though, we didn't walk the whole creek. We kind of walked around, but that's cool though. That's cool. It's a new furthest video. More people over here. Oh, that's cool. We must be closer to the real part of the park where everybody use all the time. Oh. Whoa, that's ice. That whole rock right there, ice. This is dope to me. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm gonna name this too, a new furthest. New furthest. Uh, the name of this video should be New Furthest. Okay, Morning Walk. We gotta name it Morning Walk. February 6th, Saturday, February 6th. Morning Walk. New Furthest. New Mike. Or no, New Mike. New Furthest. Right? That's how we name this one. Yep. Look at this. Oh, that's deep. That's deep. That's deep. Like, that's way over the boots. Ooh, and this ice. This ice. Good morning. How y'all doing? See, they are getting the right kind of steps in. I'm getting the fun steps in. <laughs> Look at that, though. Hey, that's dope. Whoa, that's deep. I ain't going in there, I'll tell you that. All right. We got some more trails over here we can explore. All right, all right. Let's go around this deep spot right quick and get back in this creek right quick. Oh, this is going to be a long video today, y'all. Uh, hey, y'all can have as much of it as you want. But I do enjoy watching them while I'm editing them. So uh, I will be watching this one over and over again today until my family is ready to go somewhere. But I will be shooting some footage of wherever I go. So I don't know if it'll be in this video or tomorrow's video. But basically what I do is I put my memories in my videos. Day by day. And then I clear them out my phone because I hate how Apple keep telling me. My storage is over full. 
Well, guess what? I shoot a lot of footage. <laughs> Apple, you need to do, do something for me. Two terabytes is not enough. <laughs> hey, and this is icy. Let's walk down right here. Hey, this is going to be a long, long video today. <laughs> hey, I'm having a ball, and I ain't got nowhere to be. So, baby, I'll be here. Woo, look at this one. This is dope. Oh. That's dope how that's running around and down like that and then coming back this direction. Yep. Yep. I be deliberately doing that, yeah? <laughs> the using words with the same letter as much as possible. I, I like doing that. I don't know why. I don't know why. But I do it all the time. So just get used to it. Oh, this is tight, y'all. I don't care. I could, I could chill out here all day. Hey, good morning. Whoa, this is tight. And I hope this microphone helped out a little bit today. Look at the ice. Oh, yeah. Hey, and having two hands free. You remember when I used to do it with a microphone? Ooh. When I used to do it with the microphones, I used to have to have both hands moving. Now I got at least one hand free. Ooh, it's deep. Not deep. This is, like, perfect for these boots. I mean, these boots was like they was made for my life, y'all. Ooh. Ooh, that's ice. Ooh, that's deep. Let's walk over here. Yep. Yep. We getting them steps in, though, ain't we? Yep. That's what we doing. Oh, yeah. I'll be playing around this creek. Let's see what my steps look like. Come on, come on. 3,644. Uh, it's not that good, but I'll have 5,000 by the time I get back home. I guarantee that. Oh yeah, because guess what? I ain't gonna walk through the creek to get out of the way home. I'm gonna have to walk on the trails. And that's gonna be quicker, but it's gonna be further. I feel like I be saying goodbye in my videos and then I be like, uh, but I ain't done. I don't know when to be done. I'm just thinking, like I said, I be having fun. And I guess, like I say, <laughs> people can click out of my video when they stop having fun. So I'm kind of torn and I need input on that. What's too long for a video? And if you say 15 minutes or five minutes, I'm just gonna ignore your comment because that's never gonna happen. <laughs> Not for me. I'm not one of them YouTubers if that's what y'all trying to make me. I'm trying to connect with people on a lot longer level than that. Because I want meaningful engagements as close as possible through YouTube. I want to see that I'm making a difference. I want to be able to feel like I'm making a difference. I'm saying it works well for me in the barbershop. I work every haircut by an hour appointment. It don't take me an hour to cut nobody's hair, but it give me time to connect with them on a deeper level than, than just a haircut. And I love that. And so what I'm saying is, that's how I like to connect. And that's what I'm gonna keep doing. But I would like to know, for those who are paying attention this long, I know you paying attention. Tell me what your attention span looks like. Tell me what you need, what you look for. I'm saying, what do you what do you listen to my videos for? Somebody let me know that. Is it for the relaxation? And you're like, I wish you would just let me. I'll do a video where I don't talk that often. I love that. But sometimes I be wanting to talk. I think days where I'm having hard days, like bad days, those are the days I feel like you're more likely to see a day where I don't talk. 
because when I have negative energy, I feel like yesterday's video had a little bit of negative energy in it. And I was trying my best not to bring that to y'all. And I think on days where I have like a whole lot of negative energy going on in my life, like a lot of people have been telling me here lately that somebody in their life has passed away. And I, I, I feel horrible for hearing that. One of my uh, skating friends, I just read on social media today that his uh, uncle and his grandfather both passed away in the past couple of days. And I'm be hearing stuff like that. It be bothering me. And it's just like, I don't know. I don't know, but I be wanting to help people and listen to people and I don't know, do as much as I can for people. I'm a people person, definitely. And I think that's why I like YouTube. Because I feel like I can see that I'm making a difference. And I feel like I really, other than in the barbershop and in my kid's life and my home life, obviously I feel those are very important. I don't feel like I'm making the impact on the world that I feel like I feel like I should or I'm capable of making. I just don't know what that impact is supposed to be. I try to give when I can. I get, I feel like I give all the time. I, I feel like giving is more than just giving uh, financially. I feel like even these videos is me giving me. I don't know. I don't know. I be wanting people to see that life ain't perfect. My life ain't perfect. Nowhere near it. And I don't want to act like it is. Somebody commented on one of my videos that uh, he said just this morning, I read it, he said, uh, you don't see people post their mistakes in their videos too often. I'm thinking, I don't feel like I'm posting my mistakes. I feel like I'm posting my learn, how I'm learning. Like, if somebody looks at me badly because I'm showing them that I'm learning, like if I was acting like I was a know-it-all, then yeah, I can see people bashing me. But what I'm saying is, I don't know anything about stuff like the tractor. I'm saying, I'm showing y'all what I learned because I'm watching other people's YouTube videos and I'm learning from them and then I'm bringing it to the people who who support me because I feel like that's the best way to educate. You take what you learn from elsewhere and you show it to others. I'm not saying I'm plagiarizing. What I'm saying is I learn what I learn, I like to share. I'm not plagiarizing this creek. It's a creek that's in my yard or in my backyard in the park in my backyard. And I'm saying, to me, this is showing y'all what I'm learning every day out here. If I learn how to cook a, a omelet in, in the, the egg fryer or air fryer, I show y'all that too. But you best believe I looked at a YouTube video to learn how first. <laughs> That's how I do everything. Unless there is no YouTube video. Then what I do is I do this and ask somebody to tell me what I'm doing wrong. That's how I learn. So to me, YouTube, I'm using it as a reverse learning tool. We're going back up here. I like this. Hey, I don't know how long I've been on now, but I know I've been on a long time. Let me check this camera. Well, I don't have to. Hey, y'all. Y'all about to be real mad. Let's see, this is exactly what I'm saying. I don't know how long I've been recording, and I looked at this to check to see how long I've been recording, and it's been flashing on 23 minutes for I don't know how long. I thought I was talking on that boy. I guess I must have pushed the button. This thing is meant to be worn on your hip, I guess, because I've been walking around using it as I go, and uh, I'm gonna be honest, it ain't been recording. I don't know for how long. Let me check the camera to see how long I've been out here. Oh, wow. I've been out here 50 minutes. This has been a very, very long video. And when I looked at this and thought that I was at 23 minutes, I wondered when I hit it, but it paused then. And I've been walking around with my arm up for 30 more minutes. <laughs> so this was a bust and now it's going in my pocket. But hey, it looked like today's video is gonna be about an hour long, but we're done with this thing. Say goodbye, it can go in a pocket. Well, maybe in the first 23 minutes, you got some footage out of it that you really would like to hear. But I'm going to be honest, the best thing I found so far, far for audio has been this GoPro. GoPro Max wins again. I'm going to be honest with you, 
so far, I feel like GoPro Max has changed my life. I'm gonna be honest, now that they got that new lens for the, uh, uh, the GoPro Hero 9, it also would do what I'm doing right now very easily. It, you basically put the fish eye lens on it. Only reason I won't buy the GoPro Hero 9 now is because uh, uh, I got the Max now. So I don't need to buy the 9 because after I buy the 9, then I would have to buy the lens to convert it into the Max. And it's like, why do that? I got an eight, I got a seven. I don't need a nine, I got a max. So I'm happy with what I got. All right, we're gonna jump out right here. Cause that's deep up there, I can hear it. Oh, and this is not a good trail right here. I can see it. Oh, this is a horrible trail. Yep, we're gonna have to go up right here. Uh, uh. Oh, and this is ice. Here we go. Yep. I love coming out and getting my walks in in the morning. I'm glad I got to take you on another Fergus. Hey. Some of these videos, yeah, they're gonna be very long. That's why I keep this one to an hour, no longer. I gotta remember, I gotta upload these things too. Oh yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Here comes somebody with a few dogs. I don't know where I am right now. Never, I can't, I, I don't recall being over here before. I don't think I can get lost, but I don't know. Let me see how many steps I got. Once we hit 5,000, I'm shutting it off, yeah. I'll let y'all know. 4,389 steps. And that's because I played around, around the creek too long. But I gave y'all our video, guaranteed. Okay, I've been over here before. This is pretty cool. I came over here on the mountain bike once. Yep. Oh, yeah. This is where the drop-off was. Y'all remember? Look at this. This is where I almost ran off the hill. Yep. I don't know if y'all remember that. That's a steep drop-off. Look at that, though. This is where that water runs right there. You know the place is cut out under the tree. That's that cutoff right there. That's the place where the water runs out the hill that I be doing. So that's that. Yeah, buddy. That's steep. That's very steep. Oh, we can go down right here, though. Yeah, look. This is the hill that you come down. I came down that on my mountain bike. And I almost went that way. So now I know. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, I was wearing a helmet. <laughs> I think, yeah, I was, I was, I was. <laughs> I don't think a helmet would have helped. <laughs> Not at all. See, this is that area again. Oh, 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 oh. This is that area right here with the cutout. Yep. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get back on that trail and walk up the hill. Because we got to just get these steps and get home now. So I will be going to Costco today with the wife. Um, I probably won't be taking this camera. Uh, I like to use this camera for my morning walks and that's it really. Uh, for like B-roll and stuff, I still want to use my GoPro 8. I like that because I got the magnet on the bottom of it and it makes it so I get some cool footage when I'm out and about. This camera is too big to me. It draws too much attention. Whoa, 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 whoa. But what I will say is, I took the eight to the, uh, when I went and got the pedicure, and uh, the eight, uh, I accidentally stuck the magnet 
stuck into something while I was leaving the building. And I left it on accident. It was the camera so small. There's the waterfall again. The camera so small, nobody saw it. Nobody touched it. I came back hours later, like three, four hours later, it was dark out. And uh, the whole, um, oh, the camera was still there. So I got one other thing I want to talk about before I set this camera off. I'm thinking about doing this thing with uh, Whoop, W-H-O-O-P. If anybody who's rocking with me this long has heard of Whoop, please let me know about it. Because I'm thinking about getting into it because since I am kind of big into, I'm not gonna say big into fitness, but I do care about my fitness. I don't care. I want to see what my body is already doing. I don't want to do it to make dramatic changes. Now, what I will say is, if I do see ways to make changes, I think I will start trying to do them. I want to be as healthy as I can, as long as I can. That was the point of trying, like when I started smoking, I didn't know what I started doing. Like smoking cigarettes, that was a bad decision for me. That was over 20 years ago now. And I quit smoking, I went to vaping. Once I went to vaping, I put down cigarettes and I was done with it and it was great. But then, oh, excuse me, I'm tired. Then I went to uh, vaping and February, uh, excuse me, on Thanksgiving day of this past year, I finally kicked vaping. When I say kicked it, I still struggle, but I don't own a vape, like a vape pen anymore, or a mod, I don't own one anymore. So I have been without nicotine now since, uh, since November. I feel like I got a little bit healthier. It, it was hard. It still is hard, especially after eating. I still, like when I make videos, I wanna, and that's why my video editing, if you notice, my video editing has definitely changed since I quit nicotine. Because I was able to edit. And now it's harder to edit without the nicotine. I don't understand what it is, but I can tell it's different. And I'm saying it, it, made, it made sitting in front of a screen a lot harder for me to focus without the nicotine. It, the nicotine makes me want nicotine. But I finally feel like I've kicked it and now I'm getting a little bit more comfortable. But look how many months it is later. I said November I quit and here it is February and I'm still having problems with nicotine or craving it. So I went to candy. After I eat, I normally eat it now later. <laughs> now and later all right y'all we back at the creek oh no we gotta end it like we always do i guess huh oh look at this oh look at this i know this ain't deep oh i didn't know it wasn't deep those were leaves but it wasn't deep <laughs> but anyway i'm gonna get back to where i try to end it at at least always and I'll try and get into the creek at least a little bit to end it. But, oh, I'm at 4,989 steps. So basically, this is how long it took me to walk 5,000 steps. So I can also mention that as part of the name of this video. I got my steps in. Appreciate everybody who didn't tune in. I'm gonna get up here to the end or I try and end it at every day, but this is the furthest video. And if you made it through this whole video, I appreciate you. I don't expect it, but I appreciate it. Love each and every one of y'all. Much respect, much love. This your boy. Hey, 5,000 steps. That's what I might do every day now. 5,000 steps first thing in the morning. Who rocking with me? Let me know. Appreciate y'all. We almost there. Ooh, that was ice. 
and it was hard ice. See, it ain't even breaking. It was breaking here though. All right. You hear the water right there, but it's like I'm hurrying because I want to help y'all get out this video. <laughs> like I feel like I got an ending point now, and I'm still so far away from it. But I could be walking in the creek now. Oh yeah, here we go, baby. Ooh, this is gonna be slippery. I can already tell. Ooh, went that bad. There we go. Now this is gonna take me longer. <laughs> But we still gonna get there. Here we go. Look at that. Oh, the fish. Oh. Hey, so here we are. This is my favorite in this spot right here, guys. So this is where I'm going to end it at. I know it's a long video. Hey, I don't know what the purpose of these videos are yet, so I really don't have enough of time that I'm shooting for. Like I said, let me know what y'all think. I appreciate y'all. Hey, so... It wasn't supposed to be a video about that microphone, but you see what that microphone did? So we're right back here where we started. And I like this. We took a long route. Hey, this your boy. Make your life better today. Make a difference. Be good to somebody. You already been good to me. Appreciate y'all. Much, much respect, much love. This your boy, and I'm out. All right, I go to finish product. You getting a nice run in the day, huh? Are you getting a nice run in the day? Uh, yeah, a little bit of running, a little bit of walking. Yeah, I saw you. I saw you way on the other side earlier. Oh yeah, what are you watching? Uh, some videos. I do see YouTube and Sue Creek, like walk the streets in the morning. Awesome. What's, your, what's your YouTube channel? Shaw Street. Yep. Okay, cool. S P E A K S. Okay, thank you. Let's show how the trail. I thought for sure we'd be fishing you out of that creek. <laughs> I'm in it every morning. Are you really? Yeah. yeah. Yes, it is. Y'all do the same. <laughs>